think AI will continue to shape the future of the legal profession in a very significant way. From where I see it at the moment, I think it's just as powerful as the introduction of digital and the internet um, was in the 80s and 90s. And I think AI is the next big thing for legal. We've decided to be a really early embracer of AI and we're very excited about it. We have really talented people here who are able to adapt and are interested in experimenting with AI. So the first thing we did was set up an AI lab, which is a collaboration between our technology and innovation teams. Lander and Rogers is steering towards a future where AI is a fundamental part of legal practice. At present, we're evaluating the rapidly changing and expanding AI tech market, always looking for opportunities. We're staying at the forefront of what's happening, as well as selecting and implementing the best and most suitable tools into daily practice. Initially, Lander and Rogers is focusing on AI-based legal administration transformation and AI-powered legal research. And ultimately, I predict that AI will be supporting all areas of our legal service delivery. My view is all of them will, will lead to, to greater efficiencies and will allow us to add real value, which is you know using our legal judgment and applying that to the, the data that we can then get through using these AI models to provide you know, high quality strategic advice to our clients. For us, uh, we do a lot of admin level work, which means coming up with emails, finding information. So AI helps us a lot in that space. It reduces the time that we need to get to the point where we can find the right information to make a decision. And I think that's going to be beneficial for everyone across the board. So primarily it's about time saving. Um, there's a lot of things that with AI we can do much, much quicker than we'd be able to do without that. I think it also means that there's times when for the, the smaller files, um, you can give the same sort of level of detail preparatory work that you would ordinarily only be able to do for a larger file. At Lander and Rogers, we empower both current and future lawyers for AI's role in the legal landscape by running several initiatives. We continue to partner with top Australian universities on unique clinics for law students. Technology is impacting legal practice at a groundbreaking pace. Law graduates are entering a profession where online communications, paperless offices and cloud services are integral features of digital lawyering. At Monash University, we are building student capability to enable students to acquire a deep understanding of why and how technology can enhance legal service. In collaboration with Lander and Rogers, this university industry partnership enables law students to learn about generative AI, investigate real world cases and gain hands-on knowledge of tools on the market. During my placement, I had the opportunity to work closely with the Landers team, experiencing firsthand how they collaborate with each other and with legal tech startups to develop cutting edge solutions. Participation in the AI clinic positions future lawyers to be well equipped in navigating the evolving role AI has within the legal industry and prepares them for the opportunities that lie ahead. I think that over time, AI technologies will become more sophisticated and be able to respond more specifically to practitioner needs. The legal profession will need to adapt and grow with changing technology, while also being consistently aware of the ethical considerations regarding the use of AI. We invite our clients and the broader community to be involved with the AI Lab, as we focus on a deeper understanding of the technology as it relates to ethics, the environment, and greater access to justice. I'm the head of AI engineering at Lander Rogers, so basically that means I do a lot of the engineering and development work, building the core AI products. So there's not a day when I'm not building or prototyping or coding in any sort of capacity. We see AI shaping the legal industry in almost every way, from drafting, document comparison, uh, chronology creation, e-discovery. At every area of a lawyer's workflow, we see AI being a core a component of that. So I am very encouraged that the law societies around Australia, nationally and on a state basis, the universities and various other bodies are getting together to try to agree standard guidelines for ethical and responsible use of AI. So I find that really encouraging and I think if it's going in that direction by consensus, it will be embraced and it will be productive and it will be fabulous for the legal profession. We're at the forefront of legal innovation and we want to continue to be there because we recognise that it is a powerful tool that we can work with 
to continue to deliver great solutions for our clients.